In this video, I'm gonna removing background using selection brush tool in Affinity Photo 2 on the iPad. It's super easy, so let's get into it. Alright, so the first thing we gotta do is to duplicate our main picture or photo because this is so important. If you messed up something, you can always go back to the original one. We've done duplicating the main picture, so now we can select Selection Brush Tool. You can control the width or how big you wanna have your brush and then start brushing over our subject. There are two modes available when it comes to Selection Brush Tool. Add mode to expand the selection and subtract mode to shrink the selection. So basically you're gonna use subtract mode if you're over selecting. Once you are happy with your selection, tap the refine button over here. This is gonna help us smooth out hair, edges, and soft transition. We can adjust the brush size and start brushing to the area that we think it needs a little bit of adjustment. Try different preview to see if it looks great while adjusting. You can change the preview from transparent to black and white and so on. After you're happy with your adjustment, you can change selection to mask and then click apply. Now you can see the background has been removed from the subject. And don't worry if you still want to make some adjustment, you can still do that by selecting the mask layer and then using the brush tool with the color black to hide the mask and white to reveal the mask. So after we feel satisfied with the adjustment, we can rasterize the layer. But before we do that, I would recommend to duplicate the layer just in case if we would like to do some adjustment later. And that's basically it. That's how to remove background using selection brush tool in Affinity Photo 2 on the iPad. 